and I'm officially in Barcelona. Barcelona, Barcelona. It's really hot and humid and sunny. This is my friend Paul. We're gonna have an adventure. This hill. Because we're poor. <laughs> we can't pay for a bus. No, no, no. We can't no. pay for a scooter. We can't pay for a taxi. No, no, no. We're on a budget. We are also getting some exercise in. Here pretty, we go. Take a picture of this hill. It's a pretty steep Show hill. The hill. It's harder than I thought. Either that or we're just out of shape. It's okay. That's a good workout for today. Barcelona. Oh, we walked, I don't know, a good mile or so up, and uh, all this walking was for this. We are gonna get some tapas, tapas. That's what they're known for in Spain, tapas. It's like little food, I think. It's just like a bunch of appetizers, but it's supposed to be really good. New day in Barcelona, we are at the Sagrada Familia, which is uh, like one of the oldest churches. Holy family. It's like under construction though for like a hundred years. They're saying that it's uh, gonna be completed in 2026, which is eight years from now. It's crazy, insane. Check it out. tour guy telling people that this is supposed to emulate a forest with all these pillars representing trees I guess the colors coming <coughs> in through the lights the tour was sold out so we didn't uh, we didn't get it but what do you think you see the stained glass windows from the bottom they're a lot darker and as you go up it becomes a, uh, a little more transparent meaning as you get closer with Christ your life becomes more transparent <laughs> That's straight from what we just read from one of those <laughs> walls. One thing I want to talk about is the World Cup. Now that we're in Spain, Ibiza is in Spain. See, Spain, um, sad to say, have been eliminated from the World Cup. Um, in my opinion, they are a good passing team, good mid midfielders, but they didn't have um, a lot of offensive creativity to be able to score in the final third, and uh, that's how they lost uh, eventually to Russia because it went to penalty kicks. It shouldn't have gone to penalty kicks, really. Um, but I am recording this now right before the quarterfinals are starting, and my picks would be, uh, be France. I think France is the most balanced team left in the tournament and my dark horse candidate is Belgium. I know Belgium is playing Brazil uh, actually today, but Belgium uh, I think is very, very, very dangerous in the offense and um, 
I think they're, they're going to give Brazil some trouble. So I would say uh, my money is on France to win the tournament uh, as of now, right before the quarterfinals. All right. Officially in Ibiza. Ibiza! Wow. Weather is amazing. Nice and sunny, breezy. Uh, the weather's really nice. We're just chilling at the beach. About a good 85, 88. Straight chilling. But it's a topless beach, so I can't record much. But it's good. Ibiza, it's warm, it's a little muggy and humid, but it's raining right now. It's drizzling. It's a weird feeling. All right, Ibiza, it was fun. Now it's time to go. Peace.